Can they hear me? Final and they went with <laughs> um, yeah, perfect. Uh, yeah, I'm really excited. Um, it was a good swim. I haven't been feeling great this week, so really happy to put together something that is good. Yeah, what, what What do you think went well for you? Um, this morning I was a little bit all over the place. Like I changed speeds a few times. I just I've swam so many hundred breaststrokes in my life, but for some reason this morning I was just doing something crazy. So tonight I just wanted to make sure that I put my stroke together well and I had David and Bob look at it and warm up quite a bit um, and just really working on my extension but keeping my tempo up. So Kathleen mentioned that you're, you guys have been working together all week and really been feeding off um, the energy of one another. Yeah. Um, can Share, share a little bit about what that Yeah, what I'm so about. excited. So David and I were watching um, her swim together, and she usually goes out under world record pace, so like that's <laughs> nothing new. Um, and she Kendall knows this, Stewart so it's not too rude, but she usually kind of dies and falls off of it, but I could tell she wasn't slowing down, so right about the 75, I was like, oh my god, David, she's going to do it. And so we started like jumping up and down. I, I knew that that was coming for her pretty soon. Like I had a, a feeling it was going to happen this year, but I didn't know she was going to do it tonight, so it was really exciting. Yeah. And what's it, so after kind of a, the year of law school, what's it been like to kind of get back into the swimming mode of things with Team Elite? Um, yeah, it's been an awesome summer, and we've just had a Peter really Fish, great group uh, in San Diego, final. and it's probably and one the wall, the of the top most top fun summers Atlanta. I've Number had swimming. Um, it's nice to have other women around and we're all kind of the same age and we feed off each other really well we enjoy each other's company and it's just a blast going practice every day and I didn't know if I was going to be able to continue to swim this year with school I wasn't sure how I was going to be able to balance it all so just the fact that I was able to continue swimming I'm so grateful for and then the fact that I'm here and doing well I'm just yeah I'm really pleased and it was definitely a lot of hard work. <laughs> what is your plan going forward as far as school and swimming? Um, both. <laughs> you're you're going to still stay in D.C., well, I guess? Yes, yeah, so I'll okay. be in D.C. because I still have two years left of school. Okay. And, um, I mean, I've said this before, I'm taking swimming one step at a time. And as long as I'm able to do it and I'm still loving it, I'll still do it. So that's the plan. Alex, were you happy with that performance after everything that's gone on the last year? Yes. Meaning? <laughs> are you pleased with where you are right now? Yeah, I mean, obviously I was faster last year at this time. Um, but then again, this year's been totally different for me, and I've been balancing a lot. Um, school has been tough, and it's really busy, so pretty happy with that swim. Obviously, would love to be faster, but um, really happy with the second place finish. How have you handled the heat? Some swimmers have been uh, not too happy with it. How have you handled it? Um, yeah, it's been a challenge for sure, especially the mornings. They've been rough. I think a lot of us have been feeling kind of nauseous, dehydrated. It's, it's pretty tough, but... Um, it's much better at night, so I knew that if I could get a spot in the morning, drink lots of water. I learned that you're supposed to sip water, not chug it. That's something I learned. That helps. <laughs> you learned that this week? Yeah, because I was like chugging a ton of water and I was still feeling horrible. And then I just did a quick Google search, so thank you. Yeah. Have you had any suit ribs this week? Sorry? Have you had any suit ribs? No, luckily. Um, I tend to put my suit, new suits on in my hotel the night before I race in it. So it stretched out just a little, um, and I did tell Kathleen after her two before her two suit rips, I was like, maybe you should put it on. She's like, no, it'll be good. So we've been putting on all of our suits um, in the hotel in the air conditioning first. Did she put hers on last night then? Oh yeah. <laughs> cool. Thanks, Katie. Cool. Thank you.